हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल मेडिकल लेबोरेटरी टेक्नोलॉजीज वीडियोस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर यू अबाउट द हिमाटोलॉजी एनालाइजर मशीन इंफॉर्मेशन अरबा एलाइट थ्री दिस इज थ्री पार्ट मशीन आई विल शो यू हाउ वी कैन वर्क ऑन दिस मशीन एंड व्हाट आर द बेनिफिट एंड ड्रॉबैक ऑफ दिस मशीन देर इज बैक साइड there is switch off uh, switch on button this button i will switch on this now you will see this light blinked so it will go to on like that it will start it will load all the data all the information about calibration about reagent everything after loading it will come the it will go to the main screen good point of this machine is that there are only three reagents one is herbalize one is herba cleaner and one is herba diluent and there is waste bottle separate one thing you have to write about this is the stability of the reagent on board it's good to write when you will open your reagent after opening how is how much days is the stability of the reagent because it will affect your results so like that you can attach on your machine so after loading everything it will go to the main screen this is the point where we will keep our sample and this is the mixing rotor for edta sample whole blood it is good for 2 minutes at least you will keep on the rotor or at least 9 circles 9 to 10 circles so that sample is mixed with anticoagulant properly now you can see it came to the main screen first i will start by click the mire and i will start to click on the blank first we have to run the blank but when i will click the blank first it will go to the initialization process after initialization process automatically it will run to the blank and we will get the blank result now it came press okay to my your blank i will click okay and like that process will start it's more important to run blank test before running control because it is like a self test of machine there is a small printer already attached in the machine but if you want to attach separate printer you can attach there is one usb port for the printer here you can see that our blank result came wbc is 0.04 hemoglobin is 1 platelet is 4 rbc is 0.00 these are the four tests that in blank test result is very important to check how to check blank test result 
according to standard operating procedure the in booklet it's give of machine it is given the already result of blank test so according to that procedure wbc should be less than 0.0 0.5 and you can see our is 0.04 rbc should be less than 0.05 our came 0.00 and hb should be less than 10 our came hb1 platelet should be less than 25 and our came 4 it means our blank test is okay and we can run now patient samples or and control what are the other function of this machine i will show you now i will go to exit in the database there is the history of all patient result what we run if we want to see any patient result just i will click any this here i will click and tick mark will come and here i will click detail and this result came then i will go back if i want to delete also any result just i mark same like i will go manage and i will click delete and i will click okay it will delete in maintenance there is mm, cleaning this cleaning we can use if any clot will come we can use daily basis hard cleaning is weekly basis cleaning drain chamber is also special type of cleaning if there is any clot in machine will come i will first do drain chamber and after i will add bleach or hard cleaning and we will do further cleaning two three times after that that clot will be removed this calibration that is mostly doing by the engineer of the machine then quality control we will enter the lot number with the or values and we will run daily from here for example here i run low level control here i will click for my year and automatically how history of control is separate also we can check and here is the diagram graph now you can see the very beautiful graph we got for this control within one sd almost all graph then diagnostic also the engineer they will do and reagent status we will check daily or for example if any error will come that you have to check your reagent that time we will check the reagent like that now you can see diluent how much lies how much cleaner how much waste how much and measurement measurement is there is a chip coming with lies bottle herbalize bottle this this chip that already we fix 1000 test is in this chip after 1000 test when will complete we have to change the chip and we can run further test this chip is coming with lies bottle other is settings in setting printer general date and time measurement these settings we will do and exit for when i will click exit i we have will go for shutdown process so this is the arba allied 3 machine i will recommend this machine very good for medium and small level clinics because it's enough three part machine for small level clinic but for high level hospitals it's not recommended because it is three part machine and for high studies and better studies we need five part machine so only one drawback in this machine is that this machine is not five part rest all this machine is super in result point of view in use point of view every point of view you will find this machine very easy to use and very good in result i hope you like my review about arba light 3 thank you so much now i will show you at the end one sample how to run now i keep one sample on the rotor for 2 minutes so i will run this sample first i will go in my year then i will go in new and i will go in patient id 
in patient id i will write name name of patient is nas nasra i will click enter now i will stop the rotor and i will keep this sample in the position here now as you can see that i remove the cap and i keep sample in the sample position and i will press this button just once and it go to my ear now it is sampling so now i will close the sample and i will keep out and we will see the result of this sample when it is sampling as you saw before here color was red when sampling will complete the color will become green now our result is ready what the parameters we will get in this machine hemoglobin rbc count hematocrit indices mcv mch mchc platelet total count as this is three part machine so we will get only neutrophil and lymphocyte main result other we will get mixed mono and eo if you feel more difference in between neutro and lympho you can check eosinophil manual in my next video i will show you how to do manual eosinophil count so like that we will get the result if i want the print i will click on the print if i want to run next sample i will go in new if i will go to any other function i will go, go to exit if any result wrong came and i want to run i don't want to keep this result i will click on the discard and for example if any clot came here c will come c means clot is there then first i will run blank and mostly with blank running it will go but if with running blank it will not go then i will go to the maintenance and cleaning process so like that we will get our result thank you so much for watching my video i hope you like my view about this machine and if you like my channel also please subscribe my channel so that you will get updates thank you so much and have a bright future to all of you thank you so much